Now, to start off with, this myth is about the carbon cycle. So I've got a, uh, just to lead into it, I've got a nice media clip explaining how the carbon cycle works. When we die, our bodies become the grass and the antelope eat the grass. And so we are all connected in the great circle of life. The carbon dioxide that we breathe has to come from somewhere. And where it comes from is the plants that we eat, which took that carbon from the atmosphere. So, Or animals got it from plants. You know, whatever. Yeah, that's right. So, right. Well, well, we either eat pl animals that ate plants or we eat plants. And either way, all that biomass comes from carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere. So when we eat and then breathe, it's all just part of the circle of the carbon cycle. Okay. So, John, the carbon cycle sounds so simple. Who could possibly screw that up? Well, if you were watching CNN over the weekend, you would see a good example of this. Well, there's this myth that's uh, developed around carbon dioxide that it's a pollutant, but you and I both exhale carbon dioxide with every breath, so each of us emits about two pounds of carbon dioxide a day, so are we polluting the planet? The CO2 that you breathe out came from somewhere. It's not contributing to the increase in atmospheric CO2 concentrations. And the di big difference between breathing CO2 and fossil fuel emissions is that is adding new CO2 to the atmosphere because we're digging up carbon out of the ground that's been there for millions of years. Yeah, so the stuff that's in fossil fuels is for our, for our purposes is effectively not part of the carbon cycle. And we're taking it and putting it back in. And so it's taking something that's basically in equilibrium and just adding a ton extra. So how would you characterize this um, technique that William Happer is using? How is he distorting the science with this breathing argument? It's cherry picking. It's looking at one part of the carbon cycle in isolation. Yeah. So I think I would probably characterize it as either cherry picking or oversimplification. Yeah. Oversimplification. Sure. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, just ignoring an important part of the carbon cycle.